Hey guys, this is just a basic um, thing um, to like a beginning video. I found this new program that's awesome. It's called the Yogbox. It's basically like Minecraft on steroids times a thousand. So I'm just going to do a quick little video here showing you what this new Yogbox is all about. So as you can see, yes, right now I am in an airship. Those things are pretty cool, um, and they're definitely very useful to have. Um, so in Yogbox, you can have a bunch of different uh, creations, weapons, all this stuff. And I will show you one of the creations of weapons. Like, you saw that one was a awesome airship that you can make. But also, there's countless more weapons, countless... There's just everything. It's so awesome and nice to have. So up here, I'm cooking some food, let's smelt some gold. How did I get coal ore? I have no clue. I found it in my builder's hut, actually. I do know how I got it. So having a bunch of food, and you guys might be like, well, why is he taking all this food if he might die? I mean, I mean, it's not, it seems dumb to take a bunch of items, like even if you die, but the great thing, and probably the thing that I like best about this yog box, when you die, you keep none of your items in your inventory fall out. So you keep, when you spawn, you keep everything that you had when you died. So that's a, definitely a very nice feature to have. I don't need snow, I don't need that. As you can see, a couple new uh, weapons here. A uh, Warhammer, which is pretty cool. And an Iron Flail, which is actually really good. Um, this right here is what is called a crafting table 2. Basically, you click on it, and you just have a crafting table and a book, and you put them together, and it makes it. And what it does is it just shows you all the things that you can make with what you have in your inventory, and all you have to do is click on the item, and it'll make it for it'll make it for you. So let's say I want a fire rod. So I click on it, it makes it for me, and takes the stuff out of the inventory that I used. Also, there's a great new thing called a crafting book. You right click on it and it shows you how to make every item. So, like, let's see. Back, 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 back. So, you can have, let's go to set item. Clear this. There's all these normal stuff, of course, that you guys have all seen before. Except, here's the new stuff miner's huts. I'll talk about those later. Storage tanks. I mean, there is a m bunch of new things. That is definitely great. I mean, I love it. Yawbox is amazing. Amazing program. And I'll show you guys one more basic thing about this. And then I'll do a second video. So right now, this is get my airship. The thing that is uh, definitely minus about the airship, it, airship is it does need fuel to work. So um, you need to have like wood or saplings or anything like that. But a great thing is, as you probably saw, but I'll show it to you guys again, I have, you can have an airship inventory, and you can put arrows in here, and it shoots out arrows, so it's like a warship. So let me go to my mine colony and show you guys what this is all about. So in Yogbox, you can build a bunch of different chests. For like a miner's hut, um, baker's hut, like you guys saw, citizen's huts. And basically what you do is you come here and you make a town hall chest and a builder's hut chest. And what happens is then the builder will a builder will spawn with this chest right here. This is what the chest will look like. You do have to put supplies in his chest for him to use. And he does use them up pretty quick. But like you don't have like if he needs like wooden stairs, all you have to do is put all you have to do is put wood in there. So he says he needs 12 wood, so I put wood in here. He just took the 12 wood, and now let's follow him and see what he's building. Um, let's see, working on over here. I think I actually am having him work on a lumberjack hut right now. I'm not sure. Let's follow him up here. Oh, this is a nice. Actually, this is looks like a citizen's house. So I have him building a citizen's house here because you need to have citizens to be able to, like, to have the citizens have jobs. So, up here, I'll show you. This is my miner's hut that was built. 
he definitely gets you a lot of stuff, but I just pulled it all out. He got me a ton of uh, iron and gold, actually. And what he does is he makes his own mine tunnel. Let's see if we can find him down here. So he makes his own mine tunnels, and he goes mining and just gets you um, a bunch of different things. And it's really, it's definitely helpful to have because you don't have to waste all your time mining and doing all this stuff. Wow, this guy is pretty, it's pretty elaborate. Oh, there he is. I found him, guys. So there's my miner right there. He's mining some stuff, and he says he will not work. So he gets his salary, so I guess I should go pay him his salary. So, I mean, yeah, sure, he does miss some things, but he, it also helps you out a lot to have him. Like this iron he missed, which I can just get real quick. Oh, just kidding, it fell all down there, and I don't feel like going to get it, whatever. So crystals. You, Yeah, there's also crystals in this game. It's pretty cool. Let's see if I can get back up. So let's go pay him. Oh, just a little lag there. Let's go try to pay him his salary. I don't know if I have any silver coins. What he needs to pay his salary, but we'll find out. And I have also um, a lumberjack's hut, which is also helpful because he just goes and gets you wood. And also, I'm not going to show it to you. Because I'm going to end this video here and then get out of this cave and then do like a second part to it. But it's called a lumberjack's hut. Or, no, not the lumberjack's hut. But it's called tree capitator. And what it does is basically all you have to do with an axe. You have to do it with an axe. It won't work with anything else. But you get an axe and you go to a tree and you cut the bottom log off. And it gives you everything from that tree. So all the logs, all the saplings, all the apples everything out of that tree and that also helps you a lot let me see if i can go find my lumberjack hut i think it's up here there's one of my lumberjacks right there but he's not working because he wants me to pay him his salary too which i thought i did but i guess not see he has a diamond axe here he's only got me one wood so i'm gonna go figure out how to pay them their salaries and then we will see how that goes. Um, Alright, see you guys. Thanks for watching. Remember to comment, rate, and subscribe.